Problem 4.1-2. The problem statement reads, An A36 steel tubular shaft is 1 meter long and has an outer diameter of 40 millimeters. When it is rotating at 50 radians per second, it transmits 20 kilowatts of power from the motor to the pump. Determine the smallest thickness of the shaft wall if the allowable shear stress is 65 megapascals. I'll begin with the power equation. Power is equal to the applied torque times the angular velocity. I can rewrite this equation to solve for applied torque. Torque is equal to power divided by angular velocity. The power is 20 kilowatts or 20,000 watts, which is also 20,000 newton meters per second, divided by angular velocity, which is 50 radians per second. We get a torque equal to 400 newton meters. Our equation for maximum shear stress in a shaft is equal to internal torque T times the radius C divided by polar moment of inertia J. We can set this equal to our allowable shear stress because the maximum shear stress in the shaft will not be allowed to exceed the allowable stress. I can expand the equation like this. T is the applied torque. C is the outer radius of the shaft. Our polar moment of inertia for a hollow shaft is pi over 2 times the outer radius to the fourth power minus the inner radius to the fourth power. Now we will solve this equation for inner radius. I have now solved the equation above symbolically for the inner radius. Now I will substitute in values for T is equal to 400 newton meters. C naught is equal to uh, half of our outer diameter, which will be 20 millimeters, converted to meters. And tau allowable is given to us as 65 megapascals. Solving for inner radius, we get a value of 16.9 millimeters. The problem asks us to find the wall thickness of the shaft. So the thickness will be equal to the outer radius minus the inner radius. We get a value of 3.1 millimeters for the thickness of our shaft. And our problem is complete.